Hey everyone, hope everything is going well. You guys and gals know that drill. Smash that like button, subscribe if you haven't, and comment down below. Follow me on Instagram at AIH underscore sports. Follow me on my finance channel at AIH Finance. Over the past uh, few weeks, I've been getting messages from my supporters on IG saying, hey, look, you got to take a look at these influencers and what cards they're getting. And the first thing that comes to my mind, if these guys get a nice card, I'm asking the question in the back of my head, even though I may not publicly say this, are these boxes loaded? Okay. And I'm over at Santiago Sports. Uh, this is a really nice card. It's from the uh, Top Sterling set and 2023. And he also has videos of him opening it up. And I'm not going to play the audio here, but it's numbered out of five. And I swear he said it was like the first pack or something like that. And if you look at the card again closely, out of five, Nolan Ryan, Nolan Ryan, when it was the California Angels, Mike Trout, and also there's Shohei Otani. Top certified it game used gear. Okay. I went on the tops website, tried to look for the uh, checklist and also the odds. And this is a good thing that they're doing. They're putting the odds of getting the cards. That's, I like that, right? I'll tell you what I like and what I don't like. People get mad when I ask questions, but there's nothing wrong in asking questions. I'm an accountant, so that's what we do. My boss questions a lot of things that I do. That's how we roll, right? And people get offended. I, I don't know what to tell you. I'm looking at one of the checklists, Sterling set triple autograph relics. I think this is uh, probably the one here because it's a triple, okay? And you could see I matched it here, Nolan Ryan. You see Mike Trout. And then there's Shohei Otani, okay? And here's the thing. I looked at over here on this page as well. You want to look for triple because it's a triple auto relic, right? And then I looked for number two. If you looked at number two, five. Right. And you see the number two, five. OK, so what are the odds of getting this? It says that hobby pack odds, it's one out of 145. And then the hobby box odds are one out of 73. So is it entirely possible? Sure. Now, this is. Not the probability that we saw with the Backyard Bros last year, but once again, I wanted to put the stats out there based on my understanding of these cards. So, you know, I'm going to ask the question, do you think this is loaded, right? The odds don't seem crazy. Okay, I will admit that. You know, I try to do some digging here. You know, people get mad when I say, oh, I think this is loaded, right? So uh, let's like look at the numbers if they're out there. And go from there. I mean, I do think that the Cade Cunningham cards, him opening his boxes or cards with Pac-Man, that was weird, man. To be completely honest with that. Mama Breaks, going to ask the same question. Do you think this was loaded? This is out of 2023 Tops Tribute. Very nice card. Mike Trout, one of the best players over the past decade. Without a shadow of a doubt. Now he's playing on the Angels. That, that's the thing. Angels haven't won anything. In quite some time. And I was going through the checklist here. And if I want to look at this. Let's look at Trout for instance. Prime Patch Autograph Relics. I think that would probably fall under that. Bucket. Try to look for trout cards over here. And this is probably that. I, I was digging through that. 
No, uh, but anyways, um, so if I'm just going through prime patch, just we could go through all the autos, right? Like auto patches, okay. Um, one auto patches, one out of 146, but let me go to the checklist here. Trout, okay. I'm just going through trout in the checklist and seeing which probably makes sense out of this that would make sense. And uh, that doesn't make sense for that one. Base card, that's not a base card. Uh, let's look at this here. Tribute autographs one. I don't think that's it because there's a game used item in there. Tribute to nickname. No, that doesn't look like that. Olympus autographs. I see a patch. I don't see a patch when it says that. Uh, prime patch autograph. Like that. That's why I came to that conclusion that it was most likely that. And it's saying that, assuming I'm right on this, right? There's other autos here. Let's look at the other autos, okay? There's a bunch of autos, but then you have to match whatever was on the checklist to over here. Okay. And assuming that this is a prime patch auto relic, it's saying that the hobby pack odds are one out of 3,020. Hobby box odds, much better, one out of 504. Okay. Regardless, getting the best player, pretty hard to get. Okay, regardless, right? Regardless of uh, whether, let's look at the other trout um, probabilities, okay? Dual relic cards image. No, I don't see auto with that. Tribute uh, triple relics. No, I don't see. That's not it. If you look at this here, base, this is not a base card, like I said before. Tribute autographs. Okay, so let's look at tribute autographs. Tribute auto. Okay. Now, someone will be like, okay, tribute auto, the odds are much better, but this has game use material. That's why I concluded that that's not it. All right. And if I'm wrong, you know, just tell me flat I'm wrong. Maybe I'm not looking at something correctly. Tributed nickname? No, that doesn't look like this. Olympus. Let's look at Olympus here. Olympus. So the Olympus autos are a little more tricky to get. You could see... Uh, not tricky. It's one out of eight, one out of 36. Yeah, you could say it's a little harder to get. But huh, that's not it because it's game used material. That's why I came to the conclusion of prime patch autograph relics. So now let me go back to the prime patch. Prime patch. Yeah, and then it's number two one, and this says this is one out of one. So that's why I'm thinking that it's this thing here. This is these are the odds: one out of three thousand twenty, one out of five hundred four. So I'm going to ask you a question: Are these loaded? Yes or no? Coincidence? No right or wrong answers. People get mad for asking questions, but there's nothing wrong in asking questions, in my opinion. Anyways, guys and gals, let me know what you think. Remember to smash that like button, subscribe if you haven't, comment down below. Thank you. Bye.